Right now we've been telling you Iowa is in the thick of a worrying drought. Low water levels here prompting the city to take action. Departments to ask people to conserve water usage. Now up in Grimes City, leaders are encouraging people to remain aware of how much water they're using. And they do note there's been a lot of water demand over the past week, but say its water plant is producing enough water to keep up with community needs. Now Local 5 is on your side tonight and we have coverage from our team tonight. Local 5's John Diaz is in West Des Moines. West Des Moines, John, what are works like other utilities? Tell us more. Hey, Samantha. Yeah, you know, they're asking folks to cut down how often they're watering their lawn. So if you're Watering lawn four days a week. They're asking you to cut that down to three days a week. And here at West Des Moines Waterworks, they are keeping a close eye on water usage across their service area. This is the control room where we have our eyes on everything that's going on, both at the plant and out in our distribution system. That system working harder these days as demand for water goes up. Uh, it looks like we're filling back up 17th Street Tower. West Des Moines Water Works this week, one of several utilities implementing the first stage of their drought management plan. Because we had a dry year last year and a very dry spring, we're kind of setting ourselves up for a long summer if we don't see some more rainfall. Stage one calling for homeowners to cut down watering their lawns by 25%. Water meters providing real-time data. It is completely voluntary. Uh, there is no uh, going out and shutting people's water off for irrigating or anything like that. Uh, but we do have ways to at least measure and watch that. With such hot and dry days, is that even possible? Sean Edwards, general manager of A Plus Lawn and Landscape, says yes. What the city's asking for is what should be happening, but most people don't understand the watering uh, system. Tip number one, he says, water for 30 minutes every other day instead of 20 every day. You can save water just by watering longer, which will uh, soak in better, have a less evaporation, makes the roots grow deeper because that's where the, the water is. Tip number two, water early in the morning. And number three, mow your grass higher. Increasing your mowing height to three and a half inches over like your two and a half to three inches will save a ton on, on your water bill because it's going to hold that moisture in. And West Des Moines Waterworks so far has only seen a slight reduction in water usage, not as much as they'd like. They're attributing this to the fact that, you know, they're still trying to get the message out. And sometimes it takes a while to reprogram these irrigation systems. But at the end of the day, they want to keep these measures voluntary instead of mandatory. But for now, let's bring in Brad Edwards. Brad, is there really any break in the heat? <laughs> Uh, anytime soon. Yeah, we're going to have the hottest day of the year tomorrow, but we've got thunderstorms out there tonight, John, and we do have some relief from the heat, but tomorrow we're gonna have to get through 